The story all started with Hurricane Sandy, Superstorm Sandy in 2012, sitting on a couch in my apartment in Rhode Island and the power goes out. Look out the window, there's trees on the lines like right outside. So snap the picture. I'm like, I should probably share this with our utility. The company giving you power should know immediately. Like you just yeah, assume, totally. well, obviously they know. They give me power, it's not on, so they must know. And then we realized they don't know. So we figured there's, there's gonna be a better way to do it. How can we share this with them? Maybe it could help them get the lights on faster, they could roll trucks quicker, they could start doing the full rebuild, but the problem is you can't get hold of them. That's why we started to see where, who else is having this issue. Let's see what other people are talking about. And a big part of that at the time was social media. Yeah, I think once we started like yeah. investigating the type of things that people are posting, the pictures and videos, we started to realize there's operational intelligence in these photos and videos. We realized there's a lot more that can help people and help companies uh, fix some issues they're having. Anyone who publicly posts something out there on the internet world will feed into our software. We're taking that Esri platform, which is usually pins on a map, some data, and we're combining that with people's pictures and videos and what they're doing and making that map a story. In real time. Yeah. We have to have Esri technology in place to make that shareable. So uh, we're sitting here right now. I'm getting notifications that there's been a bomb threat in Tucson, Arizona. And so you're getting real time content about the police evacuating, some imagery, what it looks like. And we know exactly where it is, what the person tried to do in real time. And it's now sitting available to any first responder mm -hmm. in the other environments. Let's get to the police, let's get to the fire. Yeah, anyone, anywhere could be sharing this stuff. It doesn't just have to be social. If it's a uh, storm reports, if it's a uh, highway patrol data feed, if it's an RSS from a news station, the system can analyze it, use the same machine learning processes to figure out, is this related to the event? Keep building up the library. This is the event that's going on. And or is it a new event? And then deliver those insights. So it's not just tied to like the social media aspect. Yeah, really trying to capitalize on every event that we know of to make sure people know this technology is available and try to get it in their hands.